We like to serve food and we also like to serve a look. We often joke we don't know what came first, like our style or the restaurant. We call our cuisine tropical comfort food. It's a cruise ship, it's a tropical cabana. It's very immersive and I feel like both of us came from this angle of like wanting people to have a more deep experience with food and not just with food, but really with like dining. We met cooking Vietnamese food on a food truck in Catskill. I used to live in New York City, but kept sort of finding myself questioning why I was working so hard and paying so much rent and still didn't have any money and sort of came to this realization that I wanted to live somewhere beautiful and, and cook food. We did a pop-up here in this space before it was ours. It was called Debbie's Little Restaurant. When it was her time to retire, she was like, do you want to sign the lease? I think it's always been kind of like our desire to disrupt the traditional idea of what services I feel like my style has evolved as the restaurant has evolved. All of our staff has evolved their style also. When we started, we wanted to have merch. We started going to Salvation Army because we had our silk screen. And we were like, why don't we just do it ourselves? And really it makes so much sense with our vernacular and kind of our language that like reflect the offbeat nature and be able to curate that for our own products instead of using kind of these more like uniform looks that we could buy online. Often people arrive to the restaurant already matching and they haven't even like had a conversation about it. We so there's this lot. hive mind that's kind of developed which is really beautiful and a little scary. Yeah. <laughs> We've often talked about the space being this performative zone where you can be a chef, but you're also dancing around being a server and you're also like really working hard, like doing things in the back, but you're giving it all you got. It was always important for us to have certain things that weren't quite food. food. Yeah. During our pop-ups, we would always have like love advice to yeah. put it back on. Well, people ask us all the time, like I studied painting in college and Carla studied performance Are and installation art. Are you still the, going to the studio? Like, and yeah. they're like, ask me that in the middle of my restaurant, like <laughs> like a busy night and I'm just like, this, this is our is studio. And it's our goal really for like anyone to be able to walk in here and be like, oh, I'm at home. Or if like they don't feel that way at first, we want to make them feel like they're at home.